Today we are having ourselves a cherry soda by one of the best soda companies we have ever had. Welcome back to Rocket Pop Stop, guys. Um, like the man said, we are having one of the best cherry sodas. I think money could buy, possibly, possibly. And we haven't we'll, even opened the bottle. We'll know at the end of the video, but it is from Belvoir, or properly pronounced as Bieber. Bieber. Um, it is their Cherry Press. Now, we've had two of their sodas so far. We've had their Elderflower and their Rose Lemonade. Yes. And by far, I think in our top five, easily, <coughs> go to, <coughs> want to sit, relax, enjoy. If you've never had, like... A um, rose soda, which, what are you doing? Today? I know, I get like, you gotta try it. You're gonna think, I, I know everyone that I've ever talked to about having a rose soda has been, mm, uh, perfume, and uh, that's so girly and ladylike. It's delicious. delicious. It's delicious. It's not like you would think rose, it's its own flavor. It's not like, oh, I can smell the rose. <coughs> you can smell something in it, you don't know that it's rose. In a blind taste test, you would never know in a million years. You're like, what is this? I mean, it's just so unique. And so, and, and that reason why we're going into a soda we're not having is because we're trying to talk about how this is something that's like, wow, like this is one of a kind where it's this company makes some of the best soda we've ever had. They have a laundry list of sodas out there, and I know I. If I could invest my money and know that each of their product is good, it'd be beeper. Um, they have just an array of, I mean, if you want to go on, we have a list pulled up right now. On sizes like this, they have things like elderflower, elderflower and rose, raspberry lemonade, organic mandarin and orange, pomegranate and raspberry, homemade lemonade, English apple, lime and lemongrass. I mean, just, like, what? Lemongrass. <laughs> <coughs> and a little sneak preview for next week. Um, it's going to be winter-tastic. Another Bivor seasonal brew? Not really brew. Punch. Let's just say it's a punch. Punch, yeah. Uh, it's going to be great. Uh, be sure to check up. In. But what are you doing? You're watching this video. You're watching this. So let's get into this. Yeah, drink me chilled. It says drink me chilled, but... And that's another thing, too. Their bottles are amazing. They always have these prints behind. You have your main label and then there's another print behind. In the rose one there's roses. In the other flower there's other flowers. In this one there's a little tiny cherry. You can't see it from the camera's not strong enough. You would never be able to see it back there. But like these little intricate details everywhere that are just so one cool. of a kind. One of a kind. It's it doesn't kind of, smell like No, much. it doesn't have a very powerful well, like an Americana you're like, ooh, it's like cherry. Yeah, and, and so I mean and granted this is like <clears throat> it's a cherry press, so that was, they're the ones pressing it. Yeah. Um, it's from the 70s, that's when it began, was in the 70s. Um, and since then, they, they press it the exact same way. So. They're all natural flavors. Most, all Let's of them are it. organic, and there's no artificial flavors, there's no chemicals. I think citrus acid is the only thing that you could not have on its own, basically, in the ingredients list. Yeah. <laughs> Without having health that issues. Is... I've always told people where I work, uh, we did a soda tasting a couple weeks back. Oh, wow. And I always said Americana was the most cherry of the cherry sodas. This, this is, is by far the most... <coughs> you can't get any more cherry than this. This is a cherry, almost like cherry juice. Yeah. It's not... I mean, there's it's carbonated. Yeah, but it's... But it's not like... It's light, light, lightly carbonated. You see the bubbles in there. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's very, it's very juicy. Wow, we're just plumbing through this bottle. Yeah, well, that, that's the one thing I don't like. It's so small. It's like, come on now, I want more. I mean, literally, they, they come. How, how many? It's like seven hundred fifty milliliters. Yeah, I think it's. If it's yeah, it's got to be. For this? No, the, they're bigger bottles. Oh yeah, yeah. And it's like five serving sizes. We drink <laughs> each of us drink it like like a soda bottle. Just like, oh yeah, I get a big one now. Yeah, I mean, like, you drink it, in no time. Wow, this is it's it's crisp. It's not a dark cherry. You know that. Yeah. I don't know if you picked on that though. Nice little snort. Hmm? Came out of you. So nice little I snorted. Snort. A little snort like <laughs> Gross. It's winter. What are you going to do? Well, let's rate it. What would you rate it? Uh, give it a topping. I'm going to give it eight. Uh, I'm going to give it a seven. You're going to give it an eight? I'm going to give it an eight. There's um, one thing I'd like to change, but I want to hear you. <coughs> I'm going 
wanted to give it a 7 only because I feel like it is by far the most natural of cherry sodas. But... I feel healthy drinking it. That is true. You do feel like you're drinking like a cherry juice. I'm not drinking a which soda, I like. which is loaded with sugar and like all these other things. Yeah, but Does I... Does it have a lot of sugar in there? As far as sugar goes. <clears throat> Naturally, they kind of are higher in sugar just because of trying to preserve that. Yeah. But I don't know. I just I just think that the one biggest problem is I probably want a little bit more bubbles, so I feel like I'm drinking. That's what I was going to say. Uh, with just a little bit more carbonation to it. And keep in mind, they use their own spring water. Yeah, well, yeah. So, I don't know. I mean, they I probably want to stride from that. They want to keep it that same. Oh, I'm sure. It's probably, it's probably been the same since the 70s, so... I'm sure they don't want to be like, oh, I want more bubbles, so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so, and that, and that, in that category, I think they should keep it the way that it is, but I wish it was just a little bit more bubbly. And I think, too, it wasn't cold enough. Yeah. Well, guys, thanks again for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Let us know. Have you had any beaver, you know, sodas not made with beavers? Belvoir is what the, um... Illiterates call it, but... <coughs> have you ever had any of these? If so, we'd love to know. If you had any of the ones we haven't had, let us know how you liked it. We, you know, we'd love to try it. Okay? Yeah. Thanks, Thanks again, again for, watching. for watching. Bye! Bye. <coughs> trying to get that so on my sense. <coughs> Getting that on my sense. <coughs> <coughs>